hey guys welcome to another video welcome back to the channel just making a quick video to highlight that i have officially converted my trident not only just to a vz butt but vz butt ish trident vz butt all wheel drive um in this case i'm just gonna call it trident all wheel drive and um as you can see i mounted two more motors here um, I had a friend of mine, Squirrel Brain, flip the motor for me so that way it mounted up instead of down because due to the spacing here, there's no way to fit these tall motors here. So I had it uh, flipped up instead and it looks much nicer that way. Um, I can honestly say I now can hit some, um, some crazy accelerations um, that I couldn't have hit before with the with just the stealth burner and the um the voron gantry the trident gantry um but now i can hit some crazy accelerations and i keep in mind i'm, I'm still using that that heavy <laughs> heavy mgn 12h so it's still heavy and i can lighten up that load with mgn 9 at some point so at some point down the road i will be lightening up that gantry but for now i didn't want to have to get rid of my mgn 12 right now um so i kept it and um, so far, I'm hitting about 18K acceleration, a 200 millimeter second all around. This is printing uh, ABS. Um, and it's a nice balance to strike because right now that fan duct, the, the Tryon fan duct, is not well optimized at all. Like it, 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 the fast I print, the uglier the print gets. It print fast, but it just the uglier it gets. So I found that with the 200 millimeter second, um, all around print speed 500 millimeter travel and 250 infill seem to be a nice balance and giving me very clean as you can see the profiles on those prints are very very clean so I'm still working on kind of tuning it fine-tuning it more but right now I'm super happy with the, the outcome here so I'm using a if uh, rapid a fetus rapido ultra eye flow with of course the sharper mini on top um, and I'm really, really, like I said, I really love in this combination. It, it runs really well. Um, and with all wheel drive added, that just means more torque. So less chance of it um, losing, uh, skipping step at these higher accelerations and, um, and decelerations. And um, yeah, I'm, I'm loving it so far, guys. So, so just wanted to highlight that quick video to show you that I really like this new, uh, Again, Trident VZ, but all wheel drive setup. I'm really, really liking it. Now, I won't be converting the rest of my machines to this. I just, this is the only one that I really wanted to, to try a different gantry on. Um, I also, if I wanted to go back and revert back to like a regular boron gantry, I can. It's pretty easy to do by just removing this and removing, removing, the, removing the front portion of the um, this front 2020 extrusion and the back one. And just put back the ones that were the put back the back one that was there originally, and, I, and I'm back to a uh, regular Trident. But in this case, because I really love the quality and speed I'm already getting off of this machine, I'm most likely gonna leave it. Like I said, I'm probably gonna lighten the load um, on the X gantry by just doing MGM 12, MGM 9, I mean, instead of 12. That should lighten the load quite a bit and um net me some more speed out of it but right now at 18k uh, at 200 millimeter a second i can't even push it further but like i said the cooling is a problem hopefully if i can get someone to better optimize the cooling because i don't want to change from the 2.4 ever carriage to the 3.0 the 3.0 looks a little bit bulky for me and i really don't like the bulkiness of that um so hopefully if there's a better duck than this triumph duck like that can actually uh better uh spread the air cooling a little bit better i think it just allowed me to print a bit faster than i am now but like i said this is still pretty quick this is faster than what my um what the stealth burner was giving me with a cw2 so i'm pretty happy with that so no complaints whatsoever so like i said quick video just to showcase that um and again stay tuned for my thursday Thursday afternoon live stream of the K the Annex K3. Um, so I didn't do it last Thursday because of Ian coming through in Florida and I live in Florida, Tampa Bay area. So we didn't 
get hit as much as Fort Myers. Um, hopefully everyone recovers. Um, you know, praying for those who are, who are, who passed away from the storm and just hoping, hopefully we can recover um, uh, any belongings or any other thing that may have transpire during the, the hurricane so so i'm praying for those that were in need for sure but i'm lucky that it didn't come my way and destroyed anything um so yeah so due to the storm is why i canceled um last thursday live streaming but this thursday we'll shut all live streaming and pick up back from where we left off for the onyx k3 so yeah so i just wanted to share this video a quick video with you guys that you know it's no longer just a Trident, it's a Trident VZ, but a, you know, all wheel drive and I'm really loving it. So yeah. So anyways, guys, remember to like, subscribe, drop a comment down and hope to see you on Thursday at 4.30 for that live stream. See ya. Peace.